my idiot nephew! What did you think of the fights last night, boy? Too <laughs> bad about Tank, huh? He did all right for a bit there. The boy's got heart, I'll give him that. He just ran out of gas. He's got to get in shape. I keep telling him he's got to eat better, too. Like me. Be presentable today. Here, you need a little tonic, son. Easy. Easy now. Now try it. That's it. Good boy. You're not such a dummy after all. <laughs> what do we do before we eat? for bringing suffering to this pig so that we might derive pleasure from its simple pain. Oh yeah, and let Tank Abbott win the ultimate fighting championship. Okay? Amen! Okay, boy, go for it! to lick the pan! Yes!
killed you! Jimmy says hello! So how the hell are you? Not bad, considering this bell obstruction! Huh? Hold on, George, I gotta let one loose! You know, it's a good thing my brother grabbed you, or I would have snapped you up for myself. Oh, George, you're such a charmer! Darn right! Hey, listen, Georgie, I'm going to the beauty shop. Would you like to look after my boys for the afternoon? They're a couple of regular assholes! Slob and Ernie! Sure thing! Bring them on over! They're real good, little buggers. Thanks, honey! Yeah, yeah, yeah. See ya. You're in for a real treat, boy! Your cousin Snap and Ernie are coming over to play with you. Wait till you meet him. You'll love him. It's them. for a bit. I want you boys to babysit the lad. Okay? Watch out for him. He tends to get into things, hurts himself. Lad, listen to me. I want you to pay attention to Slab and Ernie. Do like they tell you. You might learn something. Do you understand? He understands. <laughs> Yeah, it's family values that make America great. <laughs> yep, Jimmy's in good hands. Hey, you waited a long time for this latest installment, didn't you? And you know why? Because we make them for free, for Christ's sake. Real cartoons like mine cost money. Hard cash. You think money grows on trees? No. I'll tell you what grows on trees. Wood. 
Go out in the backyard and watch a tree for a couple of minutes. See how many laughs you get. Hey, how many of you would like to see a new show every week? <laughs> Damn right you would. All right, listen. Get over to Tower and convince them that you need these cartoons so bad that you're going to break down and buy a goddamn CD. Come on, you got to buy music sometime anyway, don't you? Yeah, you do. You bunch of long-haired freaks. So buy your music a tower, and maybe if enough of you do, they'll figure it's worth to put my ugly mug in front of your faces every week. Would you like that? Of course you would. Can you imagine? A new show every week. That's right. Me. Every goddamn week. <coughs> and let me tell you, you need me. Someone's got to teach you right from wrong. I'll give you a sample. Wrong, expect something for nothing. Right. Give, and ye shall receive. That, ah, that's the beauty of capitalism. Hey, quit fiddling with that thing and pay attention. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, 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 for Christ's sake. Well, go ahead, lad. Open it. What you got there? It's your favorite cartoony type character. <laughs> Donald Bastard. It's a garbling bastard. Pull the string, boy. You can't understand a damn word he says. That's what makes him funny. What kind of animal is he anyway? A foreigner? That Walt Dizzy sure knew who to make fun of. What else you got there? Yeah. <laughs>